And I said, why not build your house here? Inhabit the place that you love. So we built a house that spot he loved on the stream, and there he lived. On a stream that winds through southwestern Pennsylvania stands the most famous modern house in America, Frank Lloyd Wright's Falling Water. Edgar Kaufman Jr. was both an apprentice to the man who created it and son of the man who commissioned it. Falling Water had a rather special function. It was a vacation house for people who lived in a city. My mother worked as well as my father. And it was something to give their lives a balance by giving them an immediate relationship with nature. about 1962 or three when I gave it away. Uh, gave it away. And then I, how long has it been unoccupied altogether with no one living? Well, I guess since then. Was there any tension between you and Mr. Wright during the design of this? Did you ever oh, disagree no. with him or on any of the design issues of it? Do I look crazy? <laughs> In uh, 1934, I came back from a long stay in Europe because money was short. And I found myself wanting to continue to try to be a painter, as I had been attempting to do in Europe. I had a friend who worked in a New York art gallery, and she told me that she had read a very interesting book, which was the autobiography of Frank Lloyd Wright. And I'd heard his name, but I really had no image of what he stood for, what his work was like at all. But I read the autobiography, and I must say, it really bowled me over thoroughly. 